Yo, what's going on guys? Waxty here, and today I'm going to show you how to do the custom gamer picture. This thing just came out, so this is like pretty new. So if you go to like my profile right now, you'll probably notice, let's see here, go to my profile. Let's go and check it out right now. So you can see I have a custom logo there. This isn't like a default um, emblem, so like normally you do like customize profile and then change gamer pick. See, I have all these default ones here on the Xbox 360, or Xbox One itself, it's not Xbox 360, I'm, I'm a goofy goober. On the Xbox 360, you used to never have custom gamer pictures as well, so this is kind of a very, very new feature, something very, very awesome. But unfortunately, you can't do it on the Xbox One console right now by itself. So let's go ahead and hop on over. Got to do this on a Windows 10 device, so Windows 10 laptop, Windows 10 desktop. And so let's, I'm gonna go ahead and just cut it right here. We're gonna hop on over to the desktop and I'll show you guys what you gotta do to get a custom gamer picture. All right, once you're on your desktop, you're gonna to wanna to scroll down and you're gonna be looking for the store. You're gonna click on the Windows menu, obviously, and you're looking for store. Click on store and then this menu right here will pop up and this is gonna be the Windows store. So in here, you're gonna to go to type in, you're type in Xbox beta and then hit enter, obviously. I didn't do that, because I forgot. So once Xbox beta is typed in, you should see an app in a second here. There it is, Xbox beta. Mine says installed, yours will say install. Obviously, I've already installed it, I already have the custom gamer picture. Um, and then as soon as this loads, there'll be a button like right here in this little bottom area that will say install. Hit install, and then once it's installed, you're gonna wanna hit launch. All right, once you have the Xbox beta app launched, you're gonna wanna click on your name your gamer tag and you'll be able to see your settings and you're going to want to hit customize and then from customize so you'll have your little logo right there you'll hit customize like you normally would do on the xbox except this time when we go to hit edit for our name and stuff it's going to let us choose a gamer picture and that's going to be loading Come on, little bud. The Xbox beta one does seem to lag a little bit, so you can do choose a custom picture. So choose custom picture, and then it's gonna open up your file browser. Something that I've already done. So there you go, it will open up your file browser. You'll be able to select your logo. Um, I'm not gonna go ahead and do this. Actually, I'll do it just so you guys can see it. So Untitled 1 is the one I wanna use. And then it's gonna load it into the Xbox beta and it'll let you scale it for frame size. Mine looks fine already, like the way it is. Hit next. And then you'll have to like agree. So they'll ask you, hey, it's gonna be have to be clean because Xbox is gonna view these. So don't be posting anything that's offensive or anything like that. Um, hit upload and you guys will be good to go. You'll have a custom gamer picture. It might take a few minutes or so for it to update, but it will show up right here. And then when you go back to your Xbox One, it will show up there as your custom gamer picture. This is hands down probably one of my favorite features on the Xbox. So I'm really, really excited that they brought this. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this little quick tutorial. I'll have some pictures below that you guys can use for the, uh, they'll be the right scale. It has to be five by, or at least 500 by 500 pixels. But I'll have some below for you guys to be able to use. But anyway, guys, this will be the end of this video on how to change your gamer picture to have a custom one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that nonsense. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.